All right, so I finished uh, three turns of this um, thing just to see how my CRT goes. And, okay, so the brownish um, guys are just three different German armies, and I wanted to keep the command and control that way. Like I said, no transfer of supply or troops, and just see how it goes. Um, and then the bluish uh, ones are the Brits. Um, and yes, it was unbalanced in the sense that I was setting it up more or less the way it is in Verdun here. Um, and then I just did, these guys were very spread across the board. So I think they were like um, 20, uh, 25s across the board, um, uh, the Germans. So the British certainly did have an overwhelm, like a, a certainly a large amount of strength points at the beginning and a ton of supply. And bad things happened really quick. So they had a three uh, three pronged attack on Lus here, um, and with 139 strength points, and they obliterated. Uh, they did uh, 33 hits, I think, something in, something monstrous. Yep, 33 hits. So even with um, the one third forced to retreat, uh, destroyed the trench, became a de devastation marker. There was it, that was still more than. Um, uh, the amount of strength points that were sitting there for that poor guy. So, uh, yeah, I think he only had 20 actually at that point, that one there. So he got uh, taken out completely. And I was like, okay, this warning bell, uh, warning bells is like, mm, don't know if this should be happening right off the bat kind of thing, like a complete obliteration of a, of um, 20 strength points of um, infantry just like that. Also, um, I did. I, at least I didn't do it in the, in this game. Is though I'm starting to clue in that since artillery cannot retreat, don't. I'm not going to keep the artillery in the front line unless I'm doing an attack. I, I got to plan it out ahead of time, kind of thing that way. That's the way I looked at it. So, and then the Germans counterattacked. They didn't do all that great. Um, let's see here. I'll take a look at what uh, what the German counterattack. Yeah, the, the German counterattack was eight hits. I mean, they were forced to retreat, so it's, uh, you know, doubled, not tripled. And then um, they didn't have a lot of strength points there to begin with. I did, um, I did, however, fully supply them. That was for sure. So then um, what did the Germans do for their, uh, for their uh, things? Um, they went, they went at it. Uh, they went at, 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 tried to take back um, Luz. Now the problem here, but the problem is, is that they were now starting to attack through um, the urban terrain kind of thing that way. So it chopped their strength points in half, even though I fully supplied them and um, uh, away we went. Plus I was using um, two different armies, I do believe uh, at that point, or yes, or maybe three. So I got, a min I got a minus two on my die roll for that, for the combined thing. Anyways, it came out to, let's see here. Uh, that was a total of 86 strength points still, um, and but uh, I was only able to do nine hits. So the uh, the British were not forced to retreat, and as you can see, what ended up happening is that the next then the next one they took they took Lens as well with overwhelming force, and now just with the sheer number of strength points, I and the G Germans have been whittle trying to whittle this guy away, but. It's just not uh, not in the cards anymore. And like I said, since uh, ba basically there's only one supply point left here, um, you can't. No one can supply their artillery. And it's uh, remember, it's it's an absolute. You got a full on supply for artillery. So I just removed everybody, uh, removed them all to the back. But after three turns, I'm going to go and digest some stuff for a little while. It's pretty vicious. Um, but yet again, it's at the extreme end. I started in with 139 and we still had, you know, and then, and then we had 40 and then, you know, more and more strength points coming in. It was difficult for the Germans to hang on to, uh, what they, what they have. And, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. It's interesting. I'll, I'll put it that way. I, I, I think I'm going to, uh, give it a go. Actually, I'm going to, uh, maybe adopt it for the, um, the Transylvanian Gambit, uh, game and see how that goes. Why not? Well, I'm not going to have these extremes anyways of like 139 strength points for those guys there. But uh, this is uh, interesting. It was interesting. Yep. Yeah. All right. Hope you're having fun. See ya.